Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of, uh, oh wait, we need to, <laughs> welcome back to another episode of HBM SMP. Today we're going to be getting, uh, be getting some oxygen. So we actually are going to need oxygen for our space mission, so, uh, yeah, we need oxygen. <laughs> so, we got a lot of the stuff we need now. We got, like, all the machines. It's been about a week since I recorded this. Well, actually, we're a couple days early, but, uh, doesn't matter. It's the 23rd. Usually I record this on Sundays, so... Alright, we're doing some preparation stuff. We're getting our gear on. Nice. That just goes into here. Basically the same as on 112. Nice. This is crazy. We're actually going to space today. Okay, so... We need to set up a system over here. Which handles the actual electricity. For, uh... This machine. And from this side, he outputs the actual oxygen into this guy. Like so. Which basically just means we just gotta connect that. And then we need some wires. Connect that to the grid. And all we have to do now is uh, actually just uh, press the switch and everything should run. We should be getting the oxygen in that and we could put the oxygen inside these tanks. So, here we go. Uh, it takes quite a while to fill up our uh, actual oxygen. So this is going to be... Uh, Kind of annoying. <laughs> also, I noticed in the ID tag that it has 2700 next to it, so there's, there's, there's 2700 different variants of this? Or is that just the. That's not the. That is technically the durability, but each variant has its own d durability, I guess. <laughs> it's a very interesting way of doing this. As you can see, uh, items that occur like that, I think there's a few of them. I don't know. Yes, we do have some other people online today. We got three people. Nice. <laughs> it's not the same people that we've always had. Time to put on the oxygen tanks. We could technically leave an owl. <laughs> uh, I would like to bring seeds, uh, more stuff, and some other stuff. Just just in case. I want some eggs, too. We, we, we need the eggs for getting chickens on the moon. <laughs> okay. Give me that. Thank you. I don't know if we're gonna get chickens on the moon this time because they might just die instantly. But, uh, it's the hope at least. All right, uh, I didn't check if we have enough fuel or anything, so uh, <laughs> there's a chance we don't have enough fuel. Also, I uh, uh, well, okay, this, this is fine. Okay, this this is perfectly acceptable. We're about to leave. Goodbye, Ert. I will never see you again, Ertlings. Oh my gosh. We're actually going to space. It's been a long time since I've done this. <laughs> this rocket does not look safe at all. It's literally vibrating so much. <laughs> We've got a long journey ahead of us. Holy crap. Earth does not exist. Oh, where are we going? Tier 4, Tier 3, Overworld. <laughs> you can't create a space station, obviously. Uh... On the overworld, there's the moon, which is right there. Oh my gosh, why are all of these so big? Just send me to the moon already, gee. Okay, slow down. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we're, we're on a server, so this is, uh, this could be bad. We don't need to slow down just yet, we don't need to slow down just yet, okay? Alright, alright, let's go that way. Nice. You can see, we are approaching the lunar surface. We are now landing. It's nighttime. No, it's daytime. Holy crap, look at me! Whoa! <laughs> the sun is close to Earth, what the heck? Dude, we've landed in space. We're cosmonauts now. Time for us to plant the flag of victory. <laughs> I've brought with us the French flag. Nice. <laughs> okay, so I, I brought a variety of equipment with us. Um, yeah. <laughs> I can't actually see any of them in the chat right now.
I'm gone. I'm in space right now, and I can't hear any of them. This is this is very. I've never done this on the server, so it's very interesting. This. Uh, just take this. All right. I I did bring us some seeds just in case. I didn't bring much dirt though. Uh, we need to start digging and setting up the capacitor buses. We also need to set up this steam engine to get steam, and uh, I think I have everything for this. <laughs> I think. Keywords. I think I have everything for this. Why is it placing in that direction? It's only going unidirectional. This is very interesting. Place down. Nice. So for this, we're gonna need a water barrel. We're gonna need a. Uh, I've got everything. It looks like. I was just, I was kind of concerned we didn't have everything, but uh, it seems that we uh, kind of do. Also, oh holy crap, we can hear them. <laughs> we we can hear them. This is interesting. Okay, <laughs> so we're in space and we can hear them. Holy crap! I forgot to bring the decontaminator. I'm pretty sure that's important. Kind of, <laughs> kind of important. Uh, guys, I'm kind of uh, concerned with our base setup. Uh oh! I was thinking this was one of those dungeons. This <laughs> is right by spawn. The goal is to use as minimum pipes as possible, so I only brought like five pipes. <laughs> only five. Ah, uh, the moon has some spooky ambient music. <laughs> We're colonizing the moon using a solar boiler. I th talk about solar panels. This is this is not solar panels. This is a solar boiler. Isn't it like dark for months on the moon? This is ridiculous. Nice, though. I I mean, we gotta get the energy going. Okay, I've got the steam engine running. This is good. This is very good. The sound of the steam engine is muffled, and it's really weird. <laughs> now, I brought with us some of the most heavy-duty capacitors. Uh... Money can craft? These guys are the gold capacitors, very nice, and uh, they can they can handle a lot of uh, stuff. It's basically with it. Five million HD, so it's basically as good as five of the copper ones, each of these, so... We're, we're about to store around ten million HD in each of these. Pretty nice. We will have an HD to RF converter right there, and we'll also have a switch just to uh, control whether they're on or off. Nice. We're running out of stuff here. <laughs> I have an oxygen sealer, compressor. I also brought a fuel loader, just in case. All right, we're going down. We're gonna put in some leaves. Why leaves? Because I'm pretty sure leaves are required to get oxygen. Yep. So it needs a lot of leaves. Lots of them. I didn't bring a whole lot of leaves, so I'm just hoping that this is enough leaves to fill our septic tank with to make a oxygen septic tank. All right, and this guy can just go up here. Connect right in. Pretty. Oh, I have more leaves. Okay, well, uh, I guess I'll go down and put those in. Okay, I'm starting to regret not bringing iron because uh, I could actually add more leaves to this. <laughs> I kind of need to add more leaves to this, in fact. It's gonna be fine. Okay, that should be good. I did bring with us a wide variety of materials to build with. So we have skist. I like skist. It's very nice, very blue. Okay, so I've started working on our moon base. It's, um,. Looking nice. This is gonna be an airlock room. Pretty good. This will be um, some kind of cylinder, is what I'm thinking for here. Uh, I just not realize we can't actually build a uh, cylinder here. It's gonna have to be a box. <laughs> Sun is setting on the moon mission. We gotta we gotta finish up building this uh, this uh, this space base here, uh, dude. Jumping into these doorways. It's incredibly difficult. <laughs> Look at this. Can't even get in. Hold on. Like, look at that. What the heck is this? I gotta put a block down to get in? You kidding me? I should just be able to jump right in. Why does the concrete look just like the moonstone? This is, this is insane. I mean, it's not the same exactly. I mean, there's a slight difference. That's more smooth. This is a bit more coarse. I like this texture. Pretty good. Oh no, the, the engine's gonna turn off. Um, <laughs> I should really go fill up my oxygen tanks while we still have power. Oh, it's very concerning. Oh, we, we have a lot of energy. We need more of these battery buffers, I think. That'd probably be a good idea. Fill up our oxygen while we're about to run out of power. Okay, the steam engine's finally off. This is crazy. <laughs> uh, is it nighttime now? The sun is setting. 
We're gonna start setting up some farms while it's uh, nighttime, so... Potatoes? Nice! <laughs> We're farming space potatoes now. Yep. Anyway, I think, uh, I think this... Whoa. What is that? Oh my gosh. This, this is the coolest base I've ever built in space so far. But I think that concludes our space activities for today. Thank you all for watching. Goodbye.